What's going on YouTube? It's Mike here. In this video guys, I just want to let you know that iOS 5.0.1 is now out for everyone to download. What this is, is this is the update from iOS 5.0. This is available on the iPad, the iPhone, and the iPod Touch. So in this update, there's a very few little things. This is from Apple. It is an iOS update, as I said. Um, there are a few little things. This wasn't really a needed update, but I guess Apple wanted to push it out there. They could have put it in a newer one, though, with more features, but it's just bug fixes. Um, and aside from bug fixes, there's the multitasking gestures now work on the iPad 1. And also, if you've been having uh, iPhone 4S battery issues, which I just ha started having the other day, this fixes it. So... Um, definitely download it if you have an iPhone 4S or maybe even an iPad 2. But aside from you jailbreakers who don't have an iPhone 4S or iPad 2 and you want to jailbreak your iPhone, iPod Touch, or iPad on iOS 5.0, wait. Don't update to iOS 5.0.1 because currently developers are working on a jailbreak for iOS 5.0 and if you update to 5.0.1, there is no way in downgrading. Of course, Apple patches that and they don't let you downgrade unless you've had it on, you've had a jailbroken on 5.0 and you have your SHSH is saved but I don't even think like Tiny Umbrella can do that because the compatibilities are just getting worse and worse so if you're looking to jailbreak your device, I'm probably confusing you, if you're looking to jailbreak your device just don't update for now, just wait there's going to be a download link to this firmware in the description, you'll get it from Felix Burns but of course if you do want with iOS 5's new feature you can download it over the air, like I did while I'm using my iPhone 4 actually to record right now, because I just don't have my regular camera, but um, I actually do have it on my iPhone 4 and I have seen uh, bug improvements along with uh, the battery improvements, which is a major thing I was definitely looking for in this iOS release. So, yeah, go ahead and download it if you have a newer device. If you have an older device and want a jailbreak, stay on iOS 5.0. Now, uh, before I end this video, I just want to explain to you guys what's been going on with me and Mike's iPod help. If you've noticed, I haven't uploaded a video in quite some time. I'm one who uploads a video almost every day. And the last time I uploaded one was like 11 days ago or 10 days ago, maybe. So it's been a lot of delay, but I'm going to explain why. I'm just going to do this quick because I don't want you, to you guys to be annoyed. Of course, you can skip the video, but um, I've wanted to take a break. There's, I've uploaded way too many videos in October with unboxings, reviews mainly reviews, um, gadgets and stuff. This has just been way too much. I needed to take a break. There was a lot that all came to me at once, so I needed the break. Also, there was nothing new that went on in the tech community. There was just nothing new, so there was no point in me really making videos. And uh, this month, I decided to take a break on review products. I haven't uh, sent out any emails to companies, but I've decided to actually take a break from that just for now. And um, that's really, like... It. I just kind of wanted to take a break, and uh, it seems to work out well, but I am back and making videos now, so you guys will be able to get the videos, and uh, you'll be happy, hopefully. So, Alright guys, if you like this video, please leave some comments below on your thoughts. Of course, rate, give this video a thumbs up, and click the subscribe button on top. Hopefully I'm going to come up with more video ideas, because, yeah, I've been out of them. Alright guys, I'll see you soon. Peace.